What are you most excited about with World of Tanks Mobilize? You know, I think the, uh, the thing we're most excited about with Blitz is, is really the ability to bring a game, the quality that we've seen in Blitz to mobile. Uh, I think a lot of games that are out there on mobile right now aren't really good games uh, from a gamer point of view. You know, a lot of them are, you know, they're deeper uh, resource management experiences or match three experiences, but Blitz is really a gamer's game. Uh, it's a seven on seven, real-time synchronous battle, just like you'd see on the PC. So we're pretty excited about it, the ability to bring that to the gamers. What's different in this mobile version versus the PC or other platform? Uh, honestly, not a lot. Uh, and we're, we're pretty proud of that. Uh, this is a game that's on par with our Xbox game, with our PC game. Uh, it really is a, uh, a very honest uh, rendition of World of Tanks. Uh, you know, it's a, it's a serious game for, for people that are into this type of game, and we're, uh, we're very proud of it. Is this just a port? Uh, you know, it really isn't. You know, we've, we've been in development of this game for the last two years, uh, and we built this game from the ground up to be a mobile title. So we didn't take our mobile, our PC assets and bring them over to mobile. You know, we built the engine, we built the game from the ground up to be a mobile title. So the controls feel good in your hands, they feel like they should on a tablet. Uh, we have a lot of customization options, so if a player is left-handed or if they want to swap around where their consumables are, where any of their components are in the game, they can shift up those controls. Uh, so it really does feel like it's a, a game that you control, you play the way you want to play. And you know, for a mobile game, that's pretty unheard of. What kind of experience can players expect? Uh, you know, if you've played our World of Tanks PC game, it's a very similar experience. Um, you know, it's, it's a game that, that feels very true to our roots there. So it's a you know, pretty fast-paced game. Each match is probably five to seven minutes, and the player is able to just get in there and have a quick battle. Um, some people play for an hour or two. Some people are just in there for, for one battle, for five or six minutes. Uh, that's about how long each of the, uh, the fights take. Uh, and you can you know, play as much as you want. As long as you, uh, you want to keep cycling in and getting into more battles, you can really go as long as you want. But it's that, uh, it's that short mobile experience I think we were trying to create there. And it seems to be working pretty well with the players so far. How do you monetize through the Apple platform? So this game, like a lot of other ones out there, is free to play. So any user can come in, they can download it from the App Store uh, and get in there and, and really have a full experience in the game without ever spending any money. Uh, we reward players in-game with experience and credits for, uh, for playing for their time, or players can choose to use the Apple in-app purchase system to buy gold within the game, and you can use that to convert your experience or to buy some of the premium tanks. Uh, but the way we've designed the game, the premium tanks are on par with the, the tanks that people train up with credits and with experience. Uh, basically, a premium tank allows somebody that may not have the time to, to really put in training up their crews, training up their, uh, their levels in our tech tree. Uh, it allows them to get in there and play at a, a higher tier tank. Um, right away and that's that's really what we monetize if people want to play quickly and don't have the time to spend to uh to train up they can buy a premium tank and get in there and be competitive with the other players is there anything else you'd like to add uh you know we'd love to hear from the players uh we have a pretty active forum community and facebook community uh we have plans for about the next year on what we want to make for the game but we'd love to hear what the players want uh we'd love to see uh, posts in the forums and uh, on Facebook, things that people want, people that, um, you know, the, the people that are playing the game, they, they can really direct what we're doing, what comes next, and uh, what type of development we're working on.